All right, I want to welcome everyone to this Zoom presentation. Come up the background noise. And this uh, short presentation is briefly explaining about the Tron wallet. And we want to do a few things in the Tron wallet. We want to know how to rename it. We also want to know how to swap Bitcoin into Tron. And we also want to know how to, which is the swap. And we also want to know how to rename it. I think I named all three of them. Rename it, swap, and hold. Uh, how to open a new account. Okay? So just give me one moment. I'll be right with you. I got to go to the other device and I will walk everyone through it. Give me one moment. All right, so here you see my Tron wallet, and you see this is in Cyberchain. So now what I'm going to do, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, assign uh, a new wallet, okay, or, an, or a new account. Okay, so the first thing you do for a new account is you hit the plus sign at the top right. So here's the plus sign at the top right next to the bell. I'm hitting the plus sign. And you see right there, the first thing says create account. Create a new account. You click on that button. Now, which one, which, which coin are you going to be creating a new account? It's Tron, which is lit up. And now that it's lit up, you can actually go down here underneath where it says number of accounts. And this one says account two. You can actually tap right there. And you can rename it. That is, that is one way to do the rename. Okay. But I'm not going to rename it right there because I want to show you the, the, the best way so that you can type in what you want. I, I pasted that in, but I want to show you the better way. So what you want to do is then after you, here, let me go back, do it this way. So now the uh, Tron coin is lit up. You want to create a new account. You just go down to the bottom and you hit create. And when you hit create, you've got to log back in with your pin number and it's creating, it says created. And there you have it, POW, it says account number two. Okay, so that's how you create uh, your new account. Now, the next thing you wanna do, you wanna change the name up there where it says account two. So down in the bottom, in the bottom right, there's a round circle with three lines, not the basketball on the left, the round circle on the bottom right with three lines. You wanna tap on that to change the name. You tap there and what pops up is a menu. And the first one at the top says address book. Now, when you, when you click that round uh, button at the bottom with the three lines, if you don't see address book, you need to just scroll it all the way down or all the way up and you will see it. That is the one you're looking for, address book. So you see this can scroll, and sometimes it's already, when you, when you tap on that button, it's in the middle somewhere like this. So you wanna make sure you scroll it to where you can get to address book. You tap on address book, and there it is. We see the accounts that I have. Cyberchain, tested, and account two. And it is locked on try at the top. So I wanna change the account two, which is the last one at the bottom. So I'm gonna tap on that. And that screen pops up, it says edit and copy. I don't wanna copy it, I want to edit it. So I'm gonna tap on the edit. And now I see where the name says account two, I wanna tap in there. 
My keyboard pops open. It's behind the number two. I'm going to hit the X on my keyboard and I'm going to take that out. And I'm going to name this one. Power of two. All right, and there's the address, the Bitcoin address, I'm sorry, the Tron address for this Tron wallet. Then you wanna click on the word edit, which will change it from account to and actually accept the new name. And now if you look down at the last one, now it says power of two. You wanna hit the back arrow up at the top right. You want to go down to the bottom in the very middle and hit the wallet, which is in the black part at the very bottom. And there it is, the new account with the name Power of Two. All right, now the last thing I want to show you is how to swap uh, your coins. So if you um, brought Bitcoin over here, and you're trying, you want to turn it into Tron, this is the way that you do it. You look up at the top and you see that there is a down arrow, a bell, and uh, uh, a plus sign. But now at the bottom, you see in the black, you see the wallet lit up in the middle. And to the right of it is a dollar sign with arrows going around in a circle. That means swap. That's how you swap them or exchange them. So you tap on the one with the dollar sign and the two arrows in the bottom uh, black area to the right of the wallet, and it lights up. And there you have two places with two different coins. So now you're wanting to exchange or swap Bitcoin for Tron. So in the top one where you have Tron, you want to tap on that down arrow. And now you want to come over here and you want to find the one you want to swap from, which is Bitcoin. So you can either scroll to it and tap Bitcoin right there, or you can type tap in the search bar and type in BTC and it'll pop right up and you tap on that. And when you tap on that, uh, let's see, I believe it'll take you to the main account of your Bitcoin and you tap on main account. And now you see there's Bitcoin at the top of the swap. Okay, now you don't, you want to swap it for Tron. So you do the same thing on the bottom. You hit the down arrow. And you can, there's the Tron right there. Tap on that and there it is, it's in there. So now um, in reading this, before I make the actual swap, it's letting me know, it says enter how much you want to swap. And the minimum value that I can swap is 0 0.00209693 Bitcoin. That's the minimum amount. Um, so the, the best way that I found out to understand how you can come up to be more than that minimum or at that minimum is I hit on 50% of what I have in my wallet. Okay, and that's telling me it's 0 0.02493. That's gonna give me 556 point coins. And that number went away. So now it says enter how much you want to swap. Uh, there the number is, so I'm going to put in point zero zero two four nine three and you didn't see anything change and the reason why is because i clicked on the 50 percent, and it just gave me the number but if i wanted to say okay i'm gonna i want 500 coins then i would just would have typed in the amount that i wanted to swap in bitcoin but you see the number there for my hit on 50. if i wanted 25 percent you see the minimum value pop back up. That's not, 25% is not enough. So I've hit on the 50%, it goes back. I'm gonna get 554 coins. 
So now I'm gonna click on next. And from the Bitcoin to the amount of Tron, and then in the box it says to use at to autocomplete uh, contact names. Um, now underneath that it says convert. Uh, let's see, the fee, it shows you the fee there. Uh, it says pay the fee with TWX. I'm gonna turn that on. Wait a minute, let me back up. I think I better pay it with Bitcoin. I'll just, yeah, because I want to try. I want to keep my try. So uh, the total amount converted in red, it shows you it's going to be 0 0.002. Down here at the bottom, it, it has a, a note for you. Swap credit may take a few minutes to be confirmed, depending on the blockchain speed, but you will be able to track the status of your transaction. The amount you receive from the swap may vary due to exchange rates, which can change quickly due to the volatility or the volatile nature of the price of cryptocurrencies. Therefore, the final rate may be slightly different once the swap has been completed. So when you come to this page, it's gonna be at the top here and you cannot see what to do next unless you scroll it up a little bit and see the convert now. So now I'm gonna tap on the convert now button Uh, let's see. It's not working. What's happening here? Give me one second. Let me see. Maybe I had to put something in here. I forgot about this. I'm going to put... And at sign, and I'm just going to put home team. And now I'm going to go down here, tap on convert. That time it, it worked. I was able to tap it. It's asking me for my code again. It's converting, as you can see, this first circle turning. Your order um, have been placed. It may take over 10 minutes to confirm the transaction. And it's showing you below is your transaction hash ID. That hash ID, if you tap on that, it will take you into uh, where your coins are being uh, uh, transferred in the blockchain. It will take you in there so that you can see how many confirmations if it's taking too long. All you do is tap on that number. You see the two little boxes at the bottom. Uh, I'm sorry, to the right of the um, the long number. And that would um, take you in. And then you just click on got it. And it takes you back to your main account. There's my Bitcoin wallet. Uh, and those coins are about to be subtracted. You see it's $49.97 uh, there. And now what I, I actually want to do is I want to go back to uh, my uh, Tron wallet. Okay. Uh, I do right there. Okay, there we go. So it was, um, that's my bad. I'm a little tired, you gotta forgive me. So the down arrow at the top, I wanna come out of my Bitcoin and I wanna go back to my uh, Tron wallet. So I tap on the down arrow and you see the Bitcoin one is lit up. I wanna tap on the Tron one. And I wanna go back to my power of two. Tap on that. And bam, there it is. I'm in my power of two. And if I want to slide it over to the side, I will just go back here and go click on Cyberchain and it will take me back to that account. 
and there it is. And that's it. That's the, um, the steps for that. Uh, you can stop this video wherever you need to stop it at. Please share this video uh, with those who are connected to you that are in the crypto space. And I wish everyone a good day. Bye for now.